this is RK. In today's video, I'm going to talk about five solutions that can help you fix Safari translation issues. Just in case you are unable to translate web pages using Safari on your iPhone or iPad running iOS 14 or iPad OS 14, these solutions can prove to be pretty helpful. So let's see how they work. Now, before getting started, make sure you have subscribed to our YouTube channel so that you won't miss any update from us. The very first thing that you must check out is to ensure that Safari's built-in translator is available in your country or not. Right now, Safari's built-in translator works only in US and Canada, so make sure that you live in the supported country where Safari translation works. Safari's built-in translator currently supports only a few languages like English, Spanish, Simplified Chinese, French, German, Russian, and Brazilian Portuguese. So make sure the language you are trying to translate is supported by Safari translation. If Safari translation is not working, even if you are living in the supported country and you are trying to translate supported languages, then launch Settings app, scroll down and select Safari and then hit Clear History and Website Data. This way, you know, you'll be able to clean up the history of Safari and uh, you know it will help Safari works more often than not it helps in getting rid of some minor issues related to Safari so give it a try as well if you are still struggling to fix Safari translation issue on your iPhone or iPad then it's time to reset all settings. Yes, it's a radical you know, solution, but more often than not, it helps in fixing some common issues. So give it a try as well. Launch settings app, then scroll down and tap on general, then tap on reset, then tap on reset all settings, enter your passcode, and then confirm by hitting reset all settings. If the problem hasn't yet been solved, then it's time to update iOS because I think that the problem could be due to a bug. And in this case, software updates is always the best bet to fix a bug. So let's try it out as well. Launch settings app, then tap on general, then tap on software update. And if there is any update available, then download and install it as usual. For the folks who can't use Safari translation because they are not living in the supported country or the language they are trying to translate is not supported by Safari, Microsoft Translator is the best bet. It works pretty well in translating Safari web pages, so you should try it out. It's really pretty simple to translate any Safari web pages using Microsoft Translator. So before getting started, ensure that you have downloaded Microsoft Translator on your device. After that, open any web page in Safari and then tap on share button. After that, scroll down and select translator. Now just wait for some time. There you go. Microsoft Translator has translated my Safari web page pretty fast as you can see here. 
and that's the reason why I love Microsoft Translator. So give it a try just in case you are unable to use Safari Translator or it's not working on your device. If you have found this guide helpful, then do like it and share it.